What's all the crap about? Pigs who have been tortured in these gas chambers. Is it painful? I was vegan for about four years. About oh, no, don't tell me ex-vegan story. What's going on, no. man? Go away! This guy's yelling at me. One man can change the world. Oh, you no. can change the world. Tortured don't in there. Put this online. Keep going down into the gas. We're going to Thank you very much. Thanks for being here and upholding our legal right to assembly. <laughs> Hi everyone. Hello. Hey. We've got the entourage here, police officers. So it's a bit early in the morning. No, it's not. It's 12, but I'm trying to wake up still. Let's go get a, a nice free space so we can have a chat. Yesterday we were shouting at this whole neighbourhood, just, just letting them know that they should all be aware that RSPCA are making a percentage of the pig products that are sold from torture. So they're essentially animal abusing scumbags. This is their local area, so we'll go around and talk to people and, and, bring, and bring this up and, and maybe create like a public pressure for them to remove themselves from the meat industry because it's a local area that might embarrass them a little bit because they should be ashamed of themselves for that, you know what I mean? Have you seen this before? Do you know what this is? Yeah. What is it? Yeah. This is a gas chamber <laughs> that the RSPCA put their assurance logo on. Have you lads seen this before? Someone already talked to you. What is it? Tell me. What did you learn? Hey, what is this? Gas chamber. So these are pigs being killed in this gas. This gas is like a fizzy gas out of a can of coke or whatever. It burns them and they experience terror and fear in this gas. About 30, 40 seconds usually, but sometimes longer before they are uh, rendered unconscious. So it's, it's like a torture method. You from Horsham? Yeah, I did. So RSPCA building's over here, right? What do you think their position is on this? Save them, don't they? Probably. They save animals? <laughs> yeah. So do you think they would endorse these? No, I don't think they choose them. They put their logo on pigs who were killed in CO2 gas, tortured in CO2 gas. Have you ever seen like RSPCA assured meat in the supermarket? with a logo on it. Like, let's say you go on there and the logo says, uh, this pig actually suffered to death in CO2 gas, aversive gas which, which causes them immense fear, respiratory distress, and agony. Do you think that's a little different to RSPCA, which is, you know what it stands for, right? So, yeah. It's against the message, isn't it? It is against their message, yeah. their own messaging. But what if I told you that the RSPCA not only put their logo on it, they get a percentage from every product sold, which actually funds RSPCA Assured. Do you think that's a conflict of interest? It is a conflict of interest. What interest do they have as a charity to tell people not to buy pork if they're making a percentage on it? Yeah, exactly. It's, it's against the example. Yeah. You should watch this uh, documentary called Pignorance on Prime now. It's only just come out three weeks ago. Oh, right. It's all to do with this whole stuff I've just talked to you about. Thank you for that. No worries, guys. Thanks for chatting to me, eh? I volunteer for them. You do? I volunteer for them. Really? So what's all the crap about? Um, babe? Babe, Joey! Joey! This guy's yelling at me. Can you come over? I'm not running, I'm yes, you are. You're, you're getting very aggressive. <laughs> he he volunteers for the RSPCN. He's volunteer, getting very aggressive. Yeah. Really? And why? why uh, do you know what this? Uh, they are uh, sure gas chambers. She just shouted me. A shout, a shouting at her. Don't be intimidating oh, towards. Don't be intimidating towards her. But I'm just saying uh, the RSPCA. This is a gas chamber. Put uh, cameras in there. Yeah. The RSPCA adorn their logo on pigs killed in gas chambers. It tortures them. Is he phoning? Is he? Is he? Is he video me? Yeah, everyone's videoing here. It's a public space, no. so yeah. I mean, I'm yeah, but uh, we. I just raised my voice. It makes military cameras natural. Okay, yeah, no, anyway, so we just, you, if you volunteer for the RSP, you don't believe me? No. It's unbelievable. You should watch this documentary that, that sh they no. admit to it. They admit to it. Okay. So if you go and buy bacon and it's got RSPCA short on there, those I pigs, like bacon. yeah, and those pigs I have like suffered. Oh, Do you yeah. eat meat? No, I don't eat meat. You're an idiot. Why? I'm off now, mate. Hey, I'm in the. the but you, um, you support animal welfare, but you're saying that the, you um, eat animals. How, uh, how can you eat animals and be in support of animal welfare? They get tortured Don't in there. Put this online. Hey, do you understand me, please? Do you understand me? I want an argument, you. I do not want online. I don't like being. You're in, unfortunately, you're in a public space, and then, you yeah, know you did engage with us, so yeah. No, you, you engage with me. You take care. Take care, my friend. See you later. But that's not animal welfare, is it? Tell the young lady. That's not actually animal welfare if you eat them. That's not good welfare, it's not human welfare. This gentleman uh, volunteers at the RSPCA, but um, he doesn't believe that RSPCA are involved with uh, CO2 gas chambers. He literally said to my face, I don't believe you. So there you go. It's even unbelievable to their own volunteers. It's 
Seen that before? I haven't. I took this picture. It's inside a gas chamber, CO2 gas chamber. What is it? It's a, a gas chamber for pigs. Oh. The RSPCA put their logo on that bacon, it tortures the animals. And he's going in there, I was like, oh, this is, this is scary. Yeah, you know, yeah, I was really right. worried yeah. for his yes. life. Yes, of course, yes. um, what are they doing? They, they gas the pigs um, in this country to kill them. It's, it's like, it's torturous for them. Is it yeah. yeah. It's really painful. So, so do you know uh, like a can of Coke, when you drink a can of Coke or a beer or something and you burp it and it hurts your, like that fizzy, burning fizz in the nose and eyes? That's the type of gas that is CO2. Why don't they just get, um, you can get these guns that shoot out. A rod, I know. They don't do that because in a gas chamber they can fit six pigs in each cage and then they've got six cages, right? It's like a ferris wheel, imagine a ferris wheel. And the, ferret, the, the gas, How long does it take to kill them? it's like 40 seconds, 30 to 40 seconds. Sometimes they're still moving after a minute, but they, they're, they're not just getting killed, they're getting tortured for like 30 seconds yeah. and they're freaking out. So if you've seen an RSPCA logo on bacon, what would you think about the product? What do you think about the animal? Exactly, exactly, that's common sense, isn't it? But the animals have been gassed in CO2. I believe in eating meat, but I believe they should be weird, like, with, with care and respect, not just as like a commodity. Yeah, yeah. but, how, but they are a commodity, so how do you, so oh, yeah. do you think, okay, sinking farmers making money, right? Think of the industry trying to make money. Can you care about money and the, the, the welfare of a sentient being at the same time? It's capitalism. You're gonna care more about the money yeah, at some point. So that's why they do this for- They're probably stress that. Oh, they know they are, There's, and every scientist agrees. And it's most of the pigs that are put in these gas chambers. Very, very intelligent. Intelligent, curious, anxious, very anxious, so they know, they know what's going on. And I, I exposed the first footage here in the UK, actually, in history. So if you watch this film here, ignorant, and I'll show you how I did it. Right, and now we're, we're pressuring what, the RSPs. What was it like? Horrible. Bro, it's like a big, dark dungeon, right? So you get in through the top of the hatch, and there's these six cages and they're covered in <laughs> covered in <laughs> and, and urine from the animals because they defecate and release all the so, so out of so fear. So yeah. I respect you. This yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a vegan, you know what a vegan is? Yeah. Yeah, I'm a vegan because uh, we don't want to support uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. this. Well, you know, I, I believe in eating meat, but meat should be a treat, you know. Okay, why would you need that treat? Why would you need it? Tell me. Um, what, 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 what difference would your life be without it? Uh, the, Ask me the, that. The thing is, I believe in nature and the laws of nature. But you don't, because you believe in fairness. Yeah, believe so fairness is not a part of nature. Nature is unfair, and it's survival um, of the fittest, and it's killing, and they kill each other. Yeah, so, but I you believe, you believe in, in I, I social. Do, I do in, believe ra in raising saying? above our lower. Exactly. So you're raising above nature. So as human beings, uh, yeah. like we've got the power to be civilized don't over nature. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we've got the power to choose whether to eat animals or not. Uh, yeah, animals in nature don't really what, have that choice, what, right? What is you know vegans a step too far for me personally? What's so, the difference between vegetarian? And so uh, let me tell you. Veganism is like a philosophy, right? Okay. If you imagine a philosophy where you're against the animals having their rights violated, like their right to life and, yes, and, and yes. being treated cruelly, yes. that's a vegan a philosophy. So it happens, it's, it's to do with like what you, like say this was made of like cow skin, yes, yes. right? That wouldn't be vegan. But like let's just say I go to the, the horse races, put money on the, on, the, on the horses and they get shot in the head afterwards. That's yeah. animal exploitation, that's not vegan. I don't like horse racing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so you don't, probably like, don't like dog fighting. and, uh, no. and it, it, Circuses uh, where they have the, 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 no, the elephants in there. So they're not vegan, that's all not vegan. So you agree with some industries yeah. like that, that are that are bad, right? Yeah. It's just that you haven't extended that to these animals here, because we've been culturally conditioned, right, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, to yeah. eat pigs, eat yeah. cows, eat chickens, yeah, yeah, yeah. and care for dogs and cats and, and yeah. elephants, oh, oh, right? I know, I know. Do you know what I'm saying? I know, I know what you're saying. So, so therefore, you're like, well, we can eat these animals. Yeah. Yeah. But you know, but they should be treated better. But you would never have that position for dogs, for example. You would never say, let's treat dogs better before we shoot them in the head and eat them I on a the steak. You know that. what I'm saying? I get it. It's because it's a cultural condition. I was a victim of it as well. Like, Listen, you, you I, know. I fully understand about uh, cult culture and conditioning and what, what you, because what, you've yeah. grown up with it. When you're g going for this, yeah. you, you're, you're missing the target. What's the target? Everybody needs to shoot at the government. I know oh, we do. And then hey, exactly, listen, we, we have quite, been. We just you, left there for a building in, 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 in London. Everybody's all got these things, and we all agree, agree that it's not right. Yeah. But trying to do that is everybody needs to unite 
But, but bro, you do have a vote, right? Let's think about this. When you go to the store yeah, and you buy bacon, right, you're voting with your dollar. You're donating to these people to torture these animals, right? Yeah, yeah. And as a vegan, like, say, say you remove your support for that. If you had enough but, information, but, 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 I think but, but, you would but, but, probably be a vegan. Yeah, 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 I, I, I just don't think that you really uh, yeah. like, have enough information because the information yeah. that people do get, which I was a victim of it as well, is green grasses, happy I've, animals, I've and all of this stuff. But if you knew what I knew, yeah. I b truly believe, because you, you like, I can but see... when I say like, chickens, I mean like, you shove me in your garden yeah. or... What I'm most concerned about is the industries yes, where, that you need yeah. to exist in order to give everyone uh, meat uh, and, and that's eggs. That's why everyone's got to... I, I if we all boycott our support, right, all of us, yeah. and then we pressure the government you know as well... What? You're never going to get anywhere doing this, as it stands. That's what everyone's... Do, or, people have told that. me my whole life. You won't get it, yeah. People have always told me my whole life, but I've made more of an impact from and doing something than from, raise, them from, raise, them from, them from thinking I'm never going to change okay. anything. And do you know what? I, I shouldn't say that because... One man can change the world. I you know. can change the world. No, no, you, no. You've got the power to change your life, you to change the lives of right. millions of yeah. others. People, and everyone I, I, who ever did something thought it was impossible to begin yeah, with. Of course, so of course. so don't ever think like that, man, because that what you're doing is you're taking the power out of your hands yeah, yeah. and you're saying it's nah, it's in the government's hands. Fuck. Yeah. No, but, you, you, everyone here has power. If, if someone's torturing animals, shouldn't give them your money. If, if you found out I had a dog charity, and I was torturing them in gas chambers. It's very simple. Like you wouldn't go, mate, hey mate, give us one of those dog burgers. See, like. see, see what the situation I'm in though at the minute. Yeah. I'm shit. You don't have the, you oh, don't have the freedom of choice no, for that. I understand there's other oh, things. So, but you can, there are ways when you skint, right? Yeah. Beans and, and, and bread and, 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 and rice and, 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 and all the that, cheap foods, bro. You know I'm, it's like time. I'm staying around at different mates' houses. And, do you know what I mean? So I have to grab a sandwich. Or, I understand, brother. Like I understand, like, brother. I, it's, it's, know, it's a little hard. But I'm just having a conversation yeah. with you, man. I'm not, I'm not telling you what no, to do. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm helping you, you think know, about this and, issue and, and, and deeper. And you're yeah, open, man, which is if great. If I ever get to a position, you know, I'm fucking... Bro, you know what, man? Speaking to like 95... 5% of people haven't been as easy a conversation as been speaking to you, man. Because you're open yeah. and you think, okay. you know, and you, and you have a heart. Okay. And I can see that you're navigating the world really carefully, you know what I mean? So I appreciate this conversation, yeah, mate, man, eh? I respect you, fam. All right, boss. Cheers, brother. Yeah. What's, no, what's your name again? Joey, man. Joey. Joey. Lovely, mate, Good to talk to you. Watch this documentary. If, you, if any yeah. of your friends got Amazon mate, Prime, you're ignorant, you're brother, right? Fucking warrior for the God, man. Keep, the don't ever think you don't have the power, right, brother? We all do. I just had a good discussion with a really nice guy, eh? Good. Pigs are killed in gas chambers and the RSPCA support it. They're over there in that building. Do you know what this is? Huh? Do you know what this is? Yeah, I watch loads of your videos. Hey brother, do you watch my videos? Loads of them. How you going bro? I was vegan for about four years. About oh, no, don't tell me ex-vegan story, what's going on bro? No, I'm now with Venezuelan. Don't get so, me. It's very, I can't believe I'm looking at you because my mum watches you. And now she's vegan, isn't she? That's she's a mom. vegan. She's still vegan. Wow. She's still going. Good on her. Well, if um, your mum can do it, why can't you? That's a pretty bad yeah, indictment on your, uh, on your uh, commitment. And I know, I know. What? What, would you, what happened? I think just minimal, just not enough information, I guess. You know, like a lot of people do things where they don't really understand. So I think not, I probably half asked it. Do you feel good? Yeah in your conscience yes. not being a vegan anymore. Oh, no. <laughs> I spoke to quite a number of people and when they actually hunt their own food, etc., and they understand the consequences of it, it's very weird that I actually speak to these people and I'm a bit more like, oh, at least they're aware. You know when you think about mass farming or you think about shops, supermarkets, where there's obviously no Dis relationship. It's a disconnect. It's disconnect. Well, you know why? Because most people can't hunt, most people yeah, won't hunt because exactly. most people aren't killers. Yeah. You know, so most people don't want to kill animals, so they yeah. have to have disconnect in order to be a, a productive industry, yeah. uh, and if, you know, a lucrative industry. They have yeah. to have disconnect from people because they don't want to see, you know, some sentient being have their head cut off of yeah. their shoulders. And I'm sure if you had to cut a, a pig's head off of their yeah. shoulders every time you wanted to eat them, yeah. you would probably just be vegan. Yeah. Like if you had to stick your fist in the anus yeah, of a cow yeah. to impregnate them yeah. every time you wanted milk and steal their calf away and hear them pining, yeah. you probably would just be a vegan. Yeah, I think it's definitely something that I'll venture towards again. I just, and I know that as well. And the reason I know it is, as we've just spoken about, you get that feeling and it's a good feeling when you're not eating it. And then it's a bad feeling when you are eating it. Yeah. And you know why you're eating it. You know, you were a little baby at one point. You never really understood how to get your own food. Yeah, so, you're conditioned yeah, to eat like, their food and it's socially acceptable yeah. and it's really easy to, no, yeah. no one's gonna hold you accountable yeah. or any your conscience can hold you accountable because it's not like you're gonna be imprisoned for mm. purchasing a chopped up animal. Yeah. Have you seen our Pignorant? Pigment. 
So if you, has your mum seen it? She probably has. Have you got Amazon Prime? I have got Amazon Prime. Check it out, Pignorant. Yeah. Watch Pignorant. Yeah. See if it maybe reignites yeah. the reason that you were a vegan to begin with. Yeah. Because it's, uh, I think a lot of people, they have a connection that they make mm. and sometimes that connection fades. Yeah. Like, uh, we sh should remember why you're vegan. I mean, like what the animals are going, these little sentient beings with mm. having this subjective experience, it should be cause egregious suffering and, and, and slaughter. Mm. So if you can have a sandwich that you forget tomorrow. I mean, this is just great injustice that's happening. Mm. You seem like a good guy. You yeah. seem like you know what, you don't oh, seem like, you. no, look, you're an honest man. It's great to meet you. I, I appreciate that you're an honest person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, And I appreciate that you feel bad that you're not a vegan. Then maybe this is your sign to- It's a bloody weird sign. But I like it, yeah. yeah. Really, really nice to meet you. Just remember, you're condemning them. You're condemning them to these gas chambers where they suffer and try to escape the gas in their own feces, you know? That's, you don't seem like that type of person to me. Lovely to meet you. Man. Say hello to your mum for me. I will do, she's called Sheila. Sheila, say hello to Sheila for me. Will do, see you later. Keep up the good work. Be vegan. Do you know what this is? It's a gas chamber. And they kill the pigs in gas chambers. Yeah, it's terrible, isn't it? And 90% of the pigs they put in these gas chambers. I, I filmed the first footage ever to come out of the UK. And I've got, yeah, it's, and they, they try to escape and it's very scary for them and they, they get in a lot of pain. Do you know the RSPCA? Yeah, they, they actually assure these and they put their logo on, on bacon from pigs who have been tortured in these gas chambers. Yeah. The RSPCA, that's why we've been protesting the RSPCA, because they shouldn't be in... Yeah, like, what does it make you think? If, if someone saw RSPCA on bacon, what would they think about the animals? Have been... Well, they not So it's misleading, isn't it? Which is why we've been protesting them. Bless you. Take care. <sighs> Bless her. She was so sensitive, wasn't she? Oh. Yeah. Japan and uh, I've been vegan 36 years. Well, really nice to meet you. Bless you for being yeah, vegan for so and many you years. As well. Thank you so much and take care. Okay. Just wanted to shake hey, your hand. Thank you, mate. Thank you very much for what you're doing. Thank you very much. What's your name? I appreciate it. I'm Cedric. Cedric, you from here, this area? I work here. Oh, do you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Are you a vegan? Yeah, I am. Bless you, mate. Yeah. Bless you so much. So yeah. Thank you. Yeah. So that's why I just wanted to. Yeah, so I appreciate that, mate. Doing, yeah. How long have you been a vegan? Three years. Three years? Yeah. Fantastic. So I think yeah. we're everywhere, eh? We're like a we're like a little underground club. Yeah. Really Everyone's coming out of the woodwork, eh? But yeah, keep doing what you're doing. Bless you, Cedric. Take Thank care. you. Bye-bye.